In this tutorial, we're going to look at equations where there is only a single term with x in it, and that term is compound. And in each case, the x term is isolated from um, the other terms. So in all these cases where it's a compound term, we can split um, off the other parts of the term by either multiplying or dividing, always doing the opposite. So if we consider this first equation, the x is being multiplied by a, so we want to get rid of multiplying by a by dividing by a, so we get x equals b over a. In this next one is slightly different. x is being multiplied by minus a, so we want to get rid of that by dividing by minus a, so we get x equals b over minus a. But by convention, we don't put um, negative signs on the bottom, so we'd write this as x equals minus b over a. On the next term, we've got two things happening. The x is being multiplied by a and divided by b. And we can deal with those at the same time by bringing the a down and taking the b up. And so we get x equals b. Now, because it's times in all of this, it's open bracket c plus d. And we're bringing the a down to be a denominator over a. In this next one, the x is um, multiplying a bracket already. Um, the x is on its own. It's being multiplied by all of this bracket. So to get x on its own, we've got to divide by all of this bracket. So we're going to bring this down. So we get x equals c over a plus b.